Beck and Ray Ferraro shortly. I'm Mike Emery. Terrific action lies ahead. We are looking forward to all of this. This game brings together two squads from the American Hockey League. Before the faceoff, let's hear from Eddie. The American Hockey League has a storied history and has seen lots of change over the years, but remains proud and competitive, which should inspire the players here tonight to leave it all on the ice. What are these two teams going to bring us? Let's just see. We'll hear from Ray Ferraro shortly. Eddie Olchek alongside me, Mike Emmerich. This playoff game is underway. Takes that pass. A great wrist shot. A textbook stick save. Binghamton's maneuvering in no man's land. Brings a shot. Terrific shot, but a great point blank save. His perfect positioning allowed him to shut down that chance. A little under three minutes played here in the first. Nothing on the scoreboard has changed. Still a pair of zeros. On to Setaguchi. Skates it into the zone. Breakaway. What's the call? Penalty shot. Boy, the defending player really worked so hard to come all the way back. All he needed to do was take another stride or two. He might not have given a call for the penalty shot on the tripping infraction. Shoots. Star! His first playoff goal. What a great memory for him. Utica is ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Pitching it to White. A shot. Big point blank save there. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. A one-timer. Oh, what a pad save. Didn't get through. Utica's in possession and moving up the wing. Carries it up the side. that pass and looks on and that one pitchforked right back into the corner and the pickup lets it go a good stick stop makes that play deep the Comets with a neutral zone possession along the wing. A diving shot block. Skates up the center zone wing. And he lets it go. Outstanding save off a chance. Moving it to Banks. Nicely into the zone. Breaks away. Brings a long pass ahead, and it's on his stick. Shoots. Outstanding point-blank save. The shooter shaking his head. Great save. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere... Just under five minutes remaining here in the first. The Comets lead 1-0. Solid face-off win. Let's it go. Just missed the net. He finished his shift right in the middle of the ice. If you can catch somebody with an open ice hit, you know that you're giving them a real joy. Binghamton's in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. In the slot. And the puck goes back out to center ice, and so everything will have to get reset. 
The Devils in their own end controlling play now. The clock has bled down to the last minute. By himself. Score! That's his first playoff goal. Well, that certainly changes the complexion of the game. That time goal has changed everything about this one. Binghamton's won that faceoff and possession established. Skill play by White. A shot. Great save. One period played. A goal scored each. That's been it. Pretty tight fisted here after the first. Fans, take a look at our scoreboard as we acknowledge tonight's special groups in attendance. The Devils, on the strength of this game tying goal, have gotten this contest back even, and maybe they're the team with the edge as we go to break. Period two of our contest is underway, and all even up. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Oh, what a hit that one was. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. And, go, and so, when you do that, you expect this. Doc, he knew he was going to have to fight after making that push league play. surprising end to this fight. You see the look on his face? He was surprised that he was able to do that. Well, these guys will have five minutes to get back dressed and get ready to go again at some point. Binghamton Binghamton's got that puck off the tie -out. Five minute major for fighting. Time in the penalty. One minute and 48 seconds. From the slot of Rister, a diving block of the shot. A point blast. Breeze Bois skating to the neutral zone. Steps in from the neutral zone. Shot. Oh, did he ever give up his body on that one? Walks the blue line. Kneeling behind the net. That shot came from right in front. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Chip to Setaguchi. Looks to make a play. Setaguchi's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. Binghamton's roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. Uh, more times than not, Doc, anytime you reach in around a player's hands that has the puck, you're going to get a hooking minor. The Comets will send out their power play unit for the first time. Nice face-off win. When you get your power play on the ice for the first time, you can really generate some momentum, whether you score or not. Have a positive power play. Let's it go. Save. That diffuses the attack for now. Black's going to be able to make that save all day. His positioning is perfect. It's not a difficult scoring chance. The Devils with a face-off win. Binghamton's looking to head man up the wing. Slot shot. Got the post low. Back out. What a tremendous hit. Oh, he thought he had more room to slide by him there. Nope, he got thumped. The Devils skated up on the Zah. He's all alone. Caught right over him and couldn't get it past. Now that's a timely save. A beautiful one. The Devils win it. He was standing in the lane and got some of it. Snapped out of the air. The 
Devils win the draw. That puck struck him in front. Cranks a blast. And a save. And the puck heads to the neutral zone, and so everybody has to get reset. It's just him. Marvelous save. No time on that one. And there's another. Goalie out of the net. Puck on his stick. No team worth its name is going to let that go. The Devils get a minor penalty for goalie interference. Goaltender looking for the puck, trying to do his job, but he was not able to because he was knocked off his feet. The Comets begin a power play, and it's a five-on-three, a great opportunity for them here. One of the biggest problems on a five-on-three is teams are too cautious. They don't shoot the puck enough, and they make it too easy for the penalty killers to kill it off. On the outside, a shot. Score! His first playoff goal. What a great have broken the tie and we're still in the second period much uncertainty about which way this game's going to go solid win at center ice now what crosses that line perfect pass wonderful play by the defense gives it to the point that one came back over the blue line. Everybody has to get back. And the coach wishes he had skates on right now. Steps across that line. Shoots. Score! A rookie. First ever in the playoffs. The Devils have now built a lead of two. Perhaps they can build on it even more before the end of the second period. The Comets got that faceoff win, now what? The power play unit has to recoil and try yet again. Pass! Slid the breeze block. Open ice hitting, it breaks free! Outstanding save, what magic to even get the shot away. Great opportunity. Better stop. Able to step behind. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Is able to move on in. Good shooting place. Shoots. He caught a piece of that one. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Beat him on that one. A long scorcher! And decides to just cover it up and get the whistle. Devils with a clean win on the draw. Binghamton's controlling play through the neutral zone. Breakaway! Binghamton's go. Look out here. What do you think? He's asking and looking for a dance partner. Shoots one. Oh, that was close. When the puck sounds hard, when it hits the end boards, that means you've missed the net. Scoring chances handed away. The Devils' minor penalty is for unsportsmanlike conduct. Binghamton's in their own end and controlling play now. One on one. Point blank save. You gotta think that's a game changing save there. He tried to break up the power play and clear it, but he failed. Takes that pass from the other point. Good work there in goal. Bodied off the puck. Can, can he beat him here? He's a penalty shot coming up. Okay. 
a rarity to see one penalty shot in the game, but we've seen more than that because the defenders can't keep up. Anytime you put your glove in the face of an opponent, you're going to get an unsportsmanlike conduct penalty. Everyone is standing. We are standing. Score! A power play goal. And it's a biggie. I don't know how he could be in much better position, Eddie. I got a clean look at this. That is a perfectly placed shot. Neutralized face-off win. Scored by number 64, Tyler Mott. And he picks it up. So on this power play, they will resume from their own end of the ice. Flings it. Got in the way of that one. Just over eight minutes still showing on the clock this period. So some success here. And they've cut the lead to just one. The Devils are out of their own end. Driving in from no man's land. Let's a shot go. Blocked away. Binghamton's continuing to probe up the wing. Shoot. Kick save. Outstanding. Gives it over to the point. It's blocked. In all alone. Save there. And that one went offside. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. And the faceoff's won. Binghamton's moving it up the wing. Trying for it. Oh, terrific save on a great chance. The goaltender shuts that one down and a superb opportunity. Brings it in for an attack. That puck left the zone, and so everybody will have to reset. Utica's power play could have made a big difference, but did not. And the linesman waves off icing. He got there first. Oh, and the pass wouldn't go. Shoots one. Score! That's his first playoff goal. this area of the ice, you're always shooting the score. The Devils now have a two-goal lead, and we're late in the second period. Do they try to protect this at least to get to the horn? And that's a face-off win. Right in front! That was a great play and goal. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. He won't have won. And so out of that, to no one's surprise, we're going to have a scrap. He was looking for some attention, and he's going to get it. That was going back into old times for those two major penalties. These games don't come along very often anymore where they're chippy, aggressive, over the line a lot of times with way too many penalties. Under three minutes to go here in the second. At this point, some good offense, some strong defense. Six goals, it's 4-2. Gets in, looks over his options here. He just ran on. Fires, can you say ping? But ricocheted off the screen. Shoots it. Oh, missed the net. They've got all the gunners out. Rips one. What a save. He scores. Two straight goals. Binghamton's lead is already enormous. Will they just sit on this now and get the horn at the end of the second? 
Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Puck sent back out of harm's way, and that will take care of this period. Two periods are in the books here. And the books could very well have some perspiration stains on it by now because these teams have worked pretty hard. But still, a third period is ahead. Period three is underway with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro. Mike Emmett. And now we'll get the penalty call. The Devils get a two-minute penalty for tripping. Utica's power play has not been a shambles. It's been very good here, and it gets another chance. They've already had some success on the power play with a power play goal earlier in the game. Biggest chance of the game. Rotten quickly back. Let's see what the power play can generate as it's gathered in by Setaguchi. Gains the zone. Puts one on. Right out of the textbook. The Devils possess the play in no man's land. Got it on his stick in the slot. Score! His first playoff goal. What a great memory for him. Binghamton's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. It's a face-off win. May not seem important in that territory, but they have possession. Shot! Rings it off the post! The guys are going to have some fun with this in the locker room after. They've already got the game in their back pocket, but this shot hits the pipe and stays out. The Devils are controlling in their own end. Got it in his own zone, back behind the net. Binghamton skating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. The Devils with possession in their own end. A terrific job on the cut pass. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Let's it go. Wonderful stop. Goalie out, grabs that one with his stick. No way he's getting by there. The puck heads to neutral zone. And look, it's just like a magnet. Everybody goes there. That one slung back out, and so there's still some more time left on the power play. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie said no chance. That's an excellent save. Took that draw and won it. The Devils in their own end, ready an attack. Goalie's one of the six guys on the ice. He can pass. He did that. The Devils' penalty is up. Good penalty kill again. Alone. Wonderful save. Binghamton's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. He keeps winning the faceoffs. His team is ahead in the game. His percentage is high, and their score is high. Very important if he can clear this puck out. Clears the zone. He's got this one, and they're after him. Score! He's got his second. Grady's stick was in a ready position and he won time to pass the goalie. Now that's great teamwork. That puck has moved quickly and crisply. Opens up some time for him to settle it down and beat the goalie. Goalie to the bench. Substitution made. Well, you can't pull the whole team, so you might as well pull the goaltender. He deserves a break here. He's getting pummeled in the net as there is just no resistance against their opponent. Eric Tangrini, assisted by number 17, Charles Quinn. 
it. Got it at the point. Big shot turn. Save. Carries it on in from center. Has it picked up. They've got a two on one. A shot. Score! The hat trick. It's not really loud in here, but they don't expect that. Binghamton's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. The Devils waiting back in their own end. Binghamton's back in its own end, trying to work forward. The lines are changing, and he holds behind. Glides to the safety behind the net. He holds back behind, waiting for line changes. Got it right back. Great opportunity, but the pass didn't connect. So back to center ice they come on that offside. And here's Ray. Hey, grady has been able to slice and dice his way through the defense most of the night. Three goals, excellent shots, a prominent player this evening. It is just another in a long line of outstanding games for him, Ray. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? The Comets have the puck at center ice. Looks ahead to start something. The Devils have had their way almost from the very beginning of this game. At certain points in the game, you start to lose your energy, but not when the game's like this. You feel like you could play for days as you pump up the scoreboard again. Great save. Puts one on. Bad save. Kicked away. This is an absolute punch in the face contest. When he wins the fight, his team grabs the energy of the game. Quick work on the faceoff. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. Knocked off. The devil setting things up in their own end. In with it now. Good grab again. Back and forth they go between the points. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Shoots. Saved with the pass. Looks for room. Puck controlled now by the defense. Passing one off now to Brisebois. So we're into the last minute. All is academic here. A solo run. Terrific save, terrific opportunity. You talk about cutting down the angle. Perfectly executed by the goaltender. From the outside, a good stick stop. Setaguchi's hooked on this play, and the arm of the referee is high. On the delayed penalty, the change is made, and the extra man is out there. The Devils are given a hooking minor. This was okay about 10 years ago. Not anymore. That's a hooking call. Solid, clean win. The Devils lug the puck in the defensive zone. Takes it to the corner. And that pass is a mess, and so they're going to have to go back out. Binghamton's got it in their own end, hoping for center. Nicely received at the point. Shot on. And a save. Trying to go to Biega. Two games, two wins. A solid early showing in this series for the victors. Confidence is building, Doc, as this series tips 2-0.